oh my god these are so beautiful actually even more beautiful uh, compared to what we see before because personally I like when the bush is smaller like this and kind of kept under control not growing taller than myself so it's so uh, pretty you know to have them here at a manageable height and then everybody's in full bloom and see yeah, in between roses you need to leave space because uh, they get sick quite often so to avoid that disease to spread so easily you need to leave space in between them also here everything has to be removed and uh, mulch added because the disease is spreading through the rain and splashes from down back on the plant like see yeah, the lower leaves have some problems but oh my god also you see it's much better to see the flowers in shadow uh, even the camera can catch the beauty and the colors much better than in sun So I've always wanted to make one video for one rose and have it from all angles and in close-up but I'm worried that you people gonna get so bored so maybe I will have to make a different channel different YouTube channel with only roses Wow So nice when they are so small <laughs> this very cute and look all the way up there truly stunning colors and let's get inside this glass house to see what they have here Wow, look what a perfect day with a little bit autumn leaves and blue sky and stunning, stunning roses. By the way, this one is called Rob Roy. <laughs> I wish I could uh, tell you the names of each rose so that you can decide if you want to have them in your garden or not. Wow. See, like when they get so tall, taller than me, that's scary, out of control. So let's get in the house here. Because uh, they have some tropical plants, but also they have workshops here. I just asked earlier. Look, there's a banana. So they ha they have workshops for customers and that is the backyard. So there we cannot get to. See here many tables to take part in those workshops. And then more really what a huge garden really incredible how much space they have oh yes so this is what I wanted to show you this is basically how it looks um, at those rose um, places where they grow them for flower shops see like such narrow uh, rows and each plant gives such a long stem so each flower is at the top of a very long stem so that you you know you cut them and sell them 
because f roses <laughs> when they get sold it looks nice to have a very long stem so that you can put them in a huge vase so this is kind of like a simulation of roses that are especially grown for um, to be sold at flower shops and let me show you one which is totally amazing new color new shape her name is sea anemone and i also have it so look at this um the shape of the petals it's basically something never seen before and this one sea anemone is made in japan um, it won the Japan flower selection a couple of years ago. Let me show you one in a slightly more open state. However, um, Interplant in Netherlands, they sell quite many of this type of petals and they are called ruffle. So if you're in Europe, you definitely have to buy those from Interplant. Interplant is just a breeder, so I don't know um, the, what shop will sell them. But really never seen before such shape of petals and gradation of color. And these are spray roses, so you can see that there are many that are going to bloom. So it's a really good deal when you, you know, have something like this at home in the vase and all these uh, flowers that are going to make you happy. <laughs> Stunning.